Welcome back to another episode of Mark the Therapist. Today, we are re-interviewing one of my previous clients, Chris. He here has been given therapy on how to talk to girls. And after learning about the amazing secret of not breathing for years on end, he has become an absolute charming lad who talks to many girls and is successful. Anyways, how are you doing at this, Chris? Who are you? Who are you? I am Mark the Therapist, and these people around me are our live studio audience from the Bronx of free people. Alright, I remember therapy. I have to learn to not breathe when I talk to girls. Let me just start over. <laughs> now, can you please tell me about any symptoms that you've been experiencing aside from possible dizziness as a side effect of not breathing for years? Uh, no, uh, my speech is okay. Uh, no. No. Well, that is absolutely amazing news. You see that, you've heard it here first, folks. Unlike what the media wants you to believe, Mark the Therapist's therapy is absolutely 100% vegan. Now, we're still gonna have to do a very fast survey of the brain just to see whether everything is in proper working order because normal doctors do checkups. So I, I think that's probably the safest thing to do. So, with somebody in the live studio audience of three people from the Bronx, Where's the applause soundtrack? Please hand me my scalpel that I may have left on the couch. That, that'll do. Now, um, are you ready? Do you give consent? Huh? He's, oh, yeah. He gives consent, fellows. Now, we've completed the stage, the first stage of the checkup off screen, so that you viewers can enjoy a more convenient uh, viewing experience. Now we're going to go on to stage two, so will my lovely studio audience hand me a pen? Now this pen is loaded with drugs, like the anesthesia, anesthesia. Now we are What's going to apply drugs. Now for the third stage of the checkup, we're going to actually do the examination of the brain. So, if you will, my unconscious fellow, would you move out of the way? Fine. Oh, oh. To... oh, oh yeah. See. <laughs> okay, now, now, okay, there's, now, as you can see, here's the lobe. It's a lobe of some sort. Um, a brain, brain lobe, um, very delicate thing to, uh, yeah. Now, um, well, we're going to fiddle Who around in here. You? I am the doctor. Now, uh, wow. Well, yeah. Now, you smell the. Uh, oh, oh. Um, and. What? And a little are bit. You okay. So everything should be all right. He does not have a tattoo. Oh, is he? He's coming. He's, he came back. He came back out. Okay, okay. Uh, welcome back to uh, Mark the Therapist, episode one. Now today, we, uh, our good friend Chris over here has come back from his anesthesia. After only five hours, not an overdose at all, completely normal. Now, how can you, can you tell me how you are feeling, Chris? Uh. You know, uh, my head kind of hurts. Uh, so, as we can tell, he is feeling absolutely fine, isn't that right? Uh, sure. Yeah, absolutely fine. No Who brain damage you? at all. I did not drop my scalpel in there. Now, uh... Who are you? I'm the doc... So, um, I suppose the only thing left to do is the payment of the money. Oh, okay, sure. Yes, ah, uh, so the total is gonna be... Three, four, 
Oh, are you a girl? Should I try talking to you? Five. No, you have to stay breathing for this bit. Now, okay, um, so I need five dollars. Nine. Seven. Eleven. Three. Five. No, no, I mean, like, five, five, like, this, this is only seven. Oh. Uh, I, you just came back, so it's all right for you to mess up your counting, but, like, a thousand. as, as the audience can see, this is only, this, this is, this, this is not five dollars, this is seven thousand. That's, uh, seven. Helpful. Five. Okay. All right, that's very good. So, now you've been cured, so, um, if you will, uh, could somebody in our amazing live studio audience from the Bronx please give this man a tour out of my place? And a round of applause. Yeah. Oh, yay, I remember again. Oh, yeah, you were that annoying girl who stole my lollipop when I was seven. You know that we have learned lots uh, about brains today. We dug into his brain and it was great. <laughs> and so you know that his brain doesn't work at all. But now that the show is done, uh, we'll not get sued.